Consent is a word we hear getting used a lot these days, but do we really understand what it means? Consent is usually used in discussions around sexual activity, but consent is something we use every day and can practice in other areas of our lives. Do we force our kids or friends to hug us or other people? Do we ask people to do things with us we know they don't want to do? For example, watching a scary movie. At the same time, the stakes are different when it comes to our bodies and consent to sexual activity. If we ask to borrow our friend's sweater and don't respect their answer, the consequences are different than disregarding someone's sexual and body boundaries. We can do significant and long-lasting harm to that person. I don't believe that most people want to harm others, but we sometimes ignore other people's well-being if there's something we want from them. And sometimes we just don't have the tools to navigate situations that have the risk of hurting someone. In order to improve our skills and reduce the risk of causing harm around consent, there are a few things we can do. One, we can believe that it matters. The most important thing we can do is care about how our actions affect and impact others. Acknowledging that there is inherent risk in sexual situations and wanting to ensure everyone is as safe as possible is a powerful first step. Two, practice consent in other areas of your life. Respecting people's boundaries and decisions in some areas will help you respect them in all areas. Three, if you're not sure, ask. We can make a lot of assumptions about what other people do and don't want based on their body language and other cues. One person's nervous laugh may be from fear and another's may be flirting. When we assume, we risk getting it wrong and making mistakes. Get used to using clear communication. Four, think about how you react to rejection. Many of us take rejection badly. We may get angry or defensive. This can prevent people from being honest with us and they may do things they don't want to do just to avoid our harsh reaction. Rejection is a normal part of life. Learning to deal with it maturely and without retaliation is very important. For more information about consent, please check out the website below.